An 18 year old pilot is in critical condition tonight after he crash landed a single engine plane in a Wauwatosa backyard. Now, the crash happened just before 3 p.m. in a neighborhood across the street from Timmerman Airport. CBS 58's Adam Reif is live on scene tonight as the investigations continue. Adam. Well, that 18 year old pilot radioed the tower saying he had engine trouble, that the engine was stalling. Now, crash investigators were on this scene for hours today, combing through the wreckage, literally piecing together what happened. They're expected out again tomorrow. Meanwhile, neighbors are shaken by what they saw and heard. Just kept coming down and it just. I'm still in shock that it, it, it happened. Amanda and her two year old daughter were on the swing set when she saw the plane crash into next door neighbor Rashawn's backyard. It was so loud that it, it shook my house. I heard a big pop, like an engine pop and metal. Neighbors say a single engine prop plane was circling Timmerman Airport for much of the day, practicing takeoffs and landings. At 2.45, the unidentified pilot radioed the tower for help. Ground reporting, uh, reporting engine failure, it's not working. I don't know what to do. Are you a solo? I'm sorry, I didn't have my flaps up. That was his last communication. Police confirmed the pilot may have been in distress before the crash. There is indication of that, but we're still investigating. We do have liaison officers in the tower over at Timmerman Field. Neighbors say the plane seemingly fell out of the sky shortly after. You never think it would happen. You know, you always see them low, but they always go low here. Rashad ran out to see what happened. His wife called 911. The pilot was still in the plane, severely injured. Just kept coaching and kept breathing. Officers arrived on the scene. Too much was like, didn't believe it because it's a plane in their backyard. Witnesses say there was no fire and no smoke, but they worried about a gasoline explosion. Emergency crews arrived within minutes trying to rescue the pilot. The fire department was taking away the, the left wing and then they were they took the door off and they got access to the pilot. I saw them pull someone out alive. He was taken to a hospital with what was described as a critical injury. As crowds gathered, the scene was taped off and the crash site was secured. Somehow no one else was injured. We've lived here almost 50 years. We never had one crash. Now, we heard from neighbor Amanda Schaumburg several times in that story. We're actually in her backyard right now. The swing set she was at is right next to me. She did say she is still shaken by what she saw, and her daughter is aware. Said her daughter was going around the house saying crash and boom today. The NTSB and FAA are helping with this investigation. Live in Wauwatosa, Adam Reif, CBS 58 News.